Hey Gemini, I hope you're doing well. This is going to be a general reading for now to December 31st. Any information you need, you can find it in the description box down below. Gemini, I do not have personals open right now, uh, but you're more than welcome to join me on Instagram or Patreon. We're going to go ahead and get into this here, Gemini, and see what we've got for you. This is for now until December 31st. All right, Gemini. I want to get some more. Jesus, okay. Um... How many majors do you have? You have four majors, okay? Four majors in a six-card spread. It's actually meant to be a three-card spread with some clarification, but I already needed clarification right off the bat here. Gemini, I feel like I feel like you're at risk for repeat of, of some sort of situation, okay? Something could be returning. Like I know you guys get so sick of hearing that, but I really feel like there's something here that has been dragging out for you. Um, for you and Taurus, I don't know what it is about you all, but for you and Taurus, I feel like, and sometimes Aquarius, like here and there, I feel like there's this weird like up and down energy with a lot of you. It was 111 when I started your reading, by the way. So um, that could be a sign for some of you. You even have an ace right here, which is considered a one uh, in the tarot. So, wow, I think that for a lot of you, there was something here where I feel like you went through an awakening, basically. I think that with the death card here, you did something hard, or it's almost as if, like, you did something that was really difficult, or, it, it like, it happened to you, if that makes sense. Some of you, it's like, you, you either made the choice to end something, or spirit ended it for you. Either way it goes, I feel like, like, a big awakening happened with this, right? And I think that you were, like, on the path to a new beginning, but it's almost as if you have been hit with a distraction of some sort. It's almost as if, Gemini, please don't get mad. If this is not your message and it's not your me message, keep in mind that it's a general reading. I think that for some of you, you could have just, like, gone back to sleep in a sense. It's almost like there was this awakening and then it's like something, like, something big happened. There was a big change and then I feel like some of you, it's like you just, you, you didn't want to deal with it anymore. I think you didn't want to deal with, like, the next level. Almost feel like there could be... And I will give you this, Gemini. I feel like what happened here was I think you stopped to take a rest. That's kind of the energy that I'm getting here. Like a lot of realizations, a lot of big changes, and I think that you just kind of stopped to take a rest. And then I feel like there's this energy that comes towards you, okay? I think that that's kind of what's... You're hearing my dog, by the way. Don't freak out, okay? I say there's this energy that comes towards you, and he has this, like, crazy growl in the background. Anyway, um... I, I feel like with this energy being present here, it's almost as if you're at risk for repeating something. And I feel that for some of you, it's it's almost like it, it's, it's tempting somehow. You know, it's tempting you somehow. Um, it feels comforting almost. But like in a way where you know it's bad for you or where you know that it's like stunting your growth in a sense. It's like, wow, I'm kind of in the same situation. Or it's almost as if you, you could feel like your progress or the things that you were passionate about before have been coming undone because of whatever it is that you've... Um, you know, like found like whatever situation it is you found yourself in, which like literally like I mean the tower, the I, I feel like you're approaching a second awakening. I feel like with the with the tower here and the ace of wands, the tower is like something sudden happening. Can be an ending, of course, but it doesn't necessarily have to be. Um, but the ace of wands energy showing up right here. I feel like suddenly you're waking up here in a situation. We're gonna get some more clarity. Um we're gonna get some more clarity and see what we've got here. What else do we have here for this? I feel like for some of you, it doesn't even have to be that, like, you, you end a situation. It could just simply be that, like, you kind of dial it back a little bit to focus on you. Yeah, I mean, you have the sun is literally right here. The sun, astrologically, the self, right? Um, you have the three of swords right here and the ten of wands. Some of you could feel like you're carrying a connection. You're like, well, this is what I was doing in the past. Like, I don't want to, you know, I don't want to carry this connection. I don't want to have, um, you know, all, all these arguments and misunderstandings. And I don't want, you know, uh, head games. I don't want to be ghosted. I don't want to be ignored. You know, whatever the case is here that you're dealing with, I feel like you dealt with it in the past and you were done with it. And I feel like on your, like in, during your healing journey here, something new entered and I feel like it looked really promising but you know I think it tempted you and instead of healing I feel like you you went for that you know I think it tempted you and you went for that and now I feel like you're feeling as if you know you're repeating a cycle basically I feel like you're waking up to that and it, again it doesn't have to be that like if this connection isn't toxic or if whatever this is is not toxic for you it's like you don't have to end it but you could just be realizing that you're engaging in toxic behaviors because of this connection um so I think that's something that you're like wow I got away from that why am I doing that again I'm not I'm not really proud of that you know so I think that for a lot of you you got the knight of pentacles energy showing up right here I feel like you're getting back on track you're getting things in order you know you're getting things in order and I feel like you're you're taking you're taking more time. Some of you, you could be like looking into 
I, I don't know. I feel like you're being more intentional. That's the best way I can describe that. The Knight of Pentacles, you're being more careful with yourself, with your heart, with your energy, with your with your intentions, you know? That's the best way I can describe it here, Gemini. Um, King of Pentacles. Yeah, because you want to be stable, you know, and I think that for a lot of you, if this is a if this is a connection or a commitment that you're moving into, I feel like you you want that to be stable and you want that to be long lasting. So you don't want to have the same habits that you had in the past. And basically, I feel like you're changing your approach, um, not only to a connection, but to um, your relationship with yourself, your connection with yourself and, you know, with your future self. So, yeah, that's what I'm seeing here, Gemini. Um, kind of heavy there uh, and i hope it made sense i hope you were able to follow along because i i had a hard time with it okay um i hope that was helpful though or fun or whatever you needed it to be details are below for anybody who's interested in instagram or patreon but if this is where we part thank you for being here i really appreciate you and you enjoy your new year bye